Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Carol, aka Cleopatra, and thank you for tuning in. Today's video is a vlog, nothing really new, mostly do vlogs anyways, but it's a very exciting day for me because, you guys, I bought myself my first car! This is my first car purchase that I did on my own, 100% paid for you know the whole process everything by myself and that's like a huge adult move okay i know some people do this stuff when they're like 16 some people do it when they're 30 years old there is no age limit to getting a car getting your first car to being proud of your finances being proud that you were able to pay for it yourself 100 percent it is under your name your insurance everything that is a huge adult goal so for anyone out there that's trying to even achieve their goals still with this pandemic going on my heart is out to you because we have to stay motivated but anyways to get into the video i hope everyone is blessed and safe please stay safe be careful as much as you can right now i'm just about to cook myself some breakfast i am going to like wash my hair um i think i want to dye my hair i got some stuff from the beauty supply yesterday so yeah so the car let me tell you guys a little bit about the car maybe i should tell you guys later about the car i think i'll tell you guys later okay hey you guys really quick because i forgot to show you this new really cool thing that i bought so just like you guys i've been buying unnecessary things on amazon i don't really find this unnecessary like this is one of the best things that i've seen the best inventions that i've seen like in a while this is oh my gosh okay let me just hurry up and tell you guys so basically it's a portable blender and you just press the button double click it you see how that does that click it off and you could just charge it through here like it has a usb port you charge it in the car you could charge it through your phone charger anything like you could charge it when you get to work anyways i probably have smoothies like every day at this point i've even made pina coladas in this like it's bad oh and ignore the sound of the sizzling that you hear because i'm just cooking my breakfast so that's the sausage cooking but oh my god no this makes life so easy because then you just blend it up and it's already in the container that you drink it out of like hello so yeah i want to speed up this little process for you guys to just see how i make my smoothie and today i just have some frozen strawberries pineapple peaches and there's mango in there and then i'm gonna use part coconut water and part of the vanilla flavored almond milk it just gives it a little bit of a sweeter taste oh and i'm gonna put some of these leaves mint leaves in there i like to taste the mint Tell him, Raven. No, no hand down, don't. I'm just saying. <laughs> You're just saying everything but the answer, which is electricity. Oh my god. Rifle, yeah, if y'all didn't watch That's So Raven as a kid, actually. Oh, she about to have a vision. Let's see what she does. <laughs> this bitch. Nah, if That's So Raven wasn't your favorite show as a kid, I don't know if we could be friends. But yeah, you guys, I'm just watching Raven while I eat my breakfast, and then, you know, we'll catch back up after I'm done. Hey, you guys, so I'm back. Um, I just went to Popeyes. I'm gonna show you guys real quick. Got a lot of Popeyes, but I'm gonna just eat some really quick because I'm really hungry, and why? Okay, that was my dad. I'm answering the phone from my father, okay? Where'd I put my scrimps? 
See, he made me lose my scrimp. Wait a minute. Oh, I was about to freak out. See, now do I want the red sauce or the tartar sauce? When you guys eat shrimp, what would you rather have it with? Tartar sauce or cocktail sauce? I eat both, but I'm saving. I'm going to save the red sauce because I only have one of those. So let me tell you guys about my car before I get it. You guys are going to see it or whatever in the next clip. But this is my first car purchase. Yay me. This is the first car that I bought with my own money, with my own paycheck. Okay, no help. Just saved up. So, I ordered the car, well, I bought the car off of um, Carvana. Have you guys ever tried Carvana? It made it very easy for me. Straightforward. Um, you can just pick whatever car you want, and then they deliver it to you. So that's what I'm doing since there's a whole pandemic. And then the car that I bought is actually coming from a place out in uh, Pennsylvania. I think it would have been like a three hour drive or something to go pick up the car i just didn't feel like doing that so depending on the um the cars or i guess the driver i don't really know what the price is how the prices go but the shipping for the car was not bad i paid four hundred dollars to get the car delivered like the delivery fee they, did they just Yo, I asked for the, they have a pack at Popeyes <clears throat> for four extra shrimp. So that's what I ordered. They gave me three. Are you dead ass? I'm tight now, but I still have more shrimp in there. I just love seafood. Like I could be a pescatarian. Back on the topic. I'm getting it delivered today in like an hour. And um, they told me that basically I'm going, they're going to take the car off of the, the, uh, whatever it's called that they're holding the car on and then if I decide to accept it I will then sign registration information because I live in New York and apparently um, car registration stuff is what from what the people from Carvana told me I keep bumping my head on this thing this is annoying from what the people from Carvana told me is that um, New York registration is like very in particular and very specific and all that extra stuff so it's like a long process you have to take a picture of your license, you have to take a picture of like your three most recent pay stubs, you have to send a picture, um, proof of residency, then you have to take a picture and send them your insurance card, like it's just like a lot. So I thought I did all that. There was like two things that I didn't do and they hit me up like, oh, if you don't get this done by 1.30. They sent this to me at 8.30 in the morning, told me if you don't get it done by 1.30 today, you're not gonna get the car. I'm like, okay, so what the hell so basically they made me create an experian account and i didn't know what experian was before this but i think i'm gonna keep it now it is a subscription you pay 21 dollars a month but it helps you boost your credit and my credit's good actually i'm proud of myself but i've only been building credit for about a year and a half now and um I'm not gonna tell you what my credit score is like that's that's kind of like TMI but my credit score just by joining Experian it boosted 20 points okay and I didn't know that it was gonna do that because they told me I just had to sign up for Experian to get a credit check and they already did a credit check but apparently that's like what they call a hard credit check so I don't know exactly what that means but they needed me to create an Experian account in order to do this hard credit check on me. So I did that and then when I saw because I know what my credit score is so I saw on the website that it was boosted 20 points i was like yo wait what so then i did some research on experian and um basically they that's what it does like because they help you boost your credit and they help you get your credit right they help you budget they help you pay your bills like it, it's like when you go if you guys go on there you're interested just go ahead and look it up and do a little bit of research because it's not that bad um but the first 30 days are free so i have my 30 days to like think about it I just hate when I'm talking and then people just come out of nowhere. Like, I'm, I'm literally sitting by myself. Uh, yeah, no, did all the process. And honestly, um, so I bought the car Friday of last week and today is Thursday and I'm getting it delivered today. So you see how fast that process was. Like I got a new car within a week. 
literally less than a week less than seven days so thank you carvana i'm so happy i'm about to go back to the house now because i got me and my boyfriend some food and now his food's getting cold but i'll see you guys when the car comes i'm gonna try to record like i hope that i'm outside when carvana pulls up because i really want to see the whole thing like i want to enjoy the whole process like i'm so proud of myself and if it wasn't for god like i wouldn't be doing this right now so thank you god love you so much you're always there pulling through for your girl like oh my gosh i'll see you guys in a little it's lit High five? That wasn't a high five. That was a low five. <laughs> so cheap. Ooh. Mm. Pretty nice. Looking pretty clean. <laughs> we say it's up. Then it's up. Perfect time to drop the diamond in my cup. Tyler Terry's on my ankles all the way up. See you trolling in that shit, not waiting up. I'm a drop in the face of this is cut. So, you guys, this is my new car. Pretty much inside looks like um, basically the same type of vibe that I had in the other car, just the, the pattern is different. And then the outside is all different or whatever, but I did a test drive. I drove it around and everything. Everything sounds good. Um, the brakes were perfect, so I'm so happy. I'm just a little tired now, you guys. That's why my vibe is down and everything. I just went over to my mom and showed my mom and dad the car. Yeah, but thank you guys for tuning into the video. I really appreciate it. And I hope everyone's being safe out there through the riots, through the looting, through the protesting, through the coronavirus. Um, through whatever else you're going through in life, just say a prayer and god will help you get through it but once again thank you guys for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe please i'm gonna be posting more videos um soon i know i've been slacking but i'm coming back this whole thing just had you know taking a toll on me but i'm good and i can't wait to post a lot of content for you guys so i'll see you in the next video bye